guys, can you do a couple of this one first, please? Thank you. Can you please? Like I said, it's been a special time for, not just for me, but I know for, for everyone involved in this team to, to have been here and, and experienced what we've had in the last 12 years. And um, like I said, we've got a very, very special group of, of players at the moment and a tight management group. Uh, we enjoy each other's company. We challenge each other on, on, on a lot of things. We don't always agree, but once we make a decision, we back each other 100%. And that's the way that, um, you know, things work for us really well. And, um, you know, I know you spoke to Alan Wynn about the World Cup. I promise you that these guys will give 100% in every game in the World Cup. And if we play as well as we played in this tournament for the last year, then we can bring home the World Cup. I think uh, you know we, we've dealt with that on uh, you know previous occasions when we've won uh, championships in the Grand Slam. The boys will have their feet firmly on the ground. Uh, we'll work hard as ever, uh, and that's the one thing which we did in the championship. In the follow weeks, uh, we worked the players, and the players worked so hard to actually make sure that when it comes to that moments that matter, we deliver. And uh, it'll be no different for Rugby World Cup preparation. They'll probably work a little bit harder because uh, obviously they're given the time that we have together and uh, the longer we stay together the better we get so uh, that, that bodes well for our Rugby World Cup preparation on the back of a fantastic uh, achievement in winning the Grand Slam. Yeah. Well I'm not sure about a fairy tale uh, look uh, what we've achieved uh, is through hard work and dedication by all the players and, uh, and, the, and the coaches and I think you know there's a lot of management and backroom staff have you know played their part as well and uh, I think the preparation for Rugby World Cup is unique. Uh, I think that you know when you look back at performances in Grand Slams and who won Grand Slams in the year of Rugby World Cup, uh, you know you don't go on to have success. But uh, there's no doubt this group of players will work as hard as always, and uh, we look forward to what is going to be probably one of the best World Cups with six or seven nations could possibly be winners. A couple of days, please. Yeah, they've been good. Um... Uh, coming back down to earth really, but um, no, it was a great result uh, Saturday, you know, when I thought uh, the manner in which, uh, which we won it as well was uh, was pleasing and uh, no, it's been, it's been great. Yeah, it did. I think um, on the three-way games as well, it was always tough in the championship. Um, yeah, it was a huge achievement, you know, we've won it sort of, especially since uh, last year, uh, changed a lot in the way we play, the way we train um, after losing to Ireland out there. Uh, quite convincingly last year, so it was it was good to get another one over them, and uh, you know to go the year on the run we've we've had as well. Uh, you know, 14 games unbeaten. You know, we're building some nice momentum now leading into the World Cup.